What's up everyone? It is April 7th, Tuesday morning. Today we're going to be doing a calorie burn challenge where I burn as many calories as I absolutely can in just 24 hours time, quarantine style, obviously because of everything that's going on in the world right now, but I thought this would be a fun challenge and a fun little thing to do to keep myself and you guys occupied. So follow me along and uh, let's do this. I've seen a lot of other people do the calorie burn challenge on YouTube, and I've seen some people do as much as 10,000 calories, so I figured why not set myself a big goal and uh, try to match that. So we're going to try to do 10,000 today. I know it's going to be super, super difficult, but hey, why not? I got nothing else to do. I got nowhere else to be. I'm going to be using my Garmin to track all my calories burnt today. There's a heart rate monitor on the back of the watch. Everything is entered into the watch, all my information, like my uh, weight age, height, all that good stuff. Oh, puppy. Let's let you out of the cage. Come on. Good girl. Oh, come here. Come here. Oh, it's a good girl. We got this little puppy a few weeks back. She's about 15 weeks now. Oh, isn't she cute? So it's one of those, like, sort of rare, overcast, gloomy-ish kind of days in Huntington Beach, but the sun is shining through a little bit over there, if you can see that. Anyway, though, the first order of business today, we're going to walk just about, I don't know, a half mile or so to the local coffee shop. Usually I just make coffee at my house because I have one of those Nespresso machines, but because of everything that's going on right now, I'm trying to support local businesses as much as possible to keep them open, you know, during this time. So, yeah, we're just going to go grab a quick cup of joe and also get my first, you know, hopefully thousand, few thousand steps or so of the day. Okay, so without the camera, I am actually 131.8, which is about somewhat normal when I wake up. So let's see how low we can get it at the end of the day. I'm about 2,000 steps in right now at, let's see, 681 calories burnt. So the watch restarts at midnight, so most of those 681 calories were actually literally just burned when I was sleeping. I'm gonna drink my coffee, get some breakfast, and get my run going. All right, so we're gonna head out to the run right now. I'm gonna start at this little low key park and then run down to the wetlands because almost no one is out there. I don't wanna stay away from people as much as possible. So I've decided just to do in like an easy, normal kind of 10 mile run and then a good chance I'm gonna double back in the afternoon, hopefully, if it's not raining too hard and probably go like another five or so. See where we're at after this run. I uh, will see you then. All right, so just finished the run. Ended up going 10.1 uh, miles. Honestly, um, felt pretty sluggish, didn't feel great, but got through it. And now I'm feeling a lot better now that I stopped running. <laughs> 1,968 calories burnt. I'm just gonna do some light stretching now, uh, some core once I get back at home, and then attempt to do some more calorie burning stuff, quarantine style. Actually, uh, what I just thought of is a great way to burn calories. You know what that would be? Would be for you to hit the like button for this video and subscribe and hit the notification bell. <laughs> Please, guys, though, really, uh, subscribing, hitting the notification bell, liking the video would help me out a ton and help me keep growing this channel. Feel free to comment like if you like this kind of video that I'm doing or what you want to see from me or if you wanted me to do other just like fitness related stuff or challenges or just running tips and tricks or how I got into running or any of that kind of stuff. Just let me know and yeah, I'd be happy to film it. I love making these videos for you guys. It just uh, makes my day and I hope it makes yours too. So yeah. Okay, so back at the house, just finished my core routine. Doesn't really burn a ton of calories, but gets the heart rate up for a little bit. Um, and then 50 push-ups on top of that. I'm just gonna eat this quick protein RX bar for a little bit of strength. And then I might do some, I don't know, a little weight training in the backyard. I don't really have much of anything. I just have a 20 pound dumbbell set, but I mean, I don't know, do a little bit, mix it up a bit, maybe burn a few calories. 21,000, or sorry, not 21,000, 2,186 calories and 15,700 steps. I don't know, 
I have no idea if you can see that in focus, but yeah, um, it is currently 10.43, so almost 11. So yeah, we gotta, we gotta keep rolling, let's do this. And there you have it. That's enough weightlifting for the year. About to do 1,000 jumping jacks, no joke. Let's do this, let's get it done. Okay, just did the first 500, took a little break. These things really hurt the balls on my feet, to be honest, but we're gonna bang out the other half right now. And uh, the heart rate is actually up from these, so they do at least somewhat work for a short period of time. So let's keep it going. Okay, so all the jumping jacks done. Gonna head walk down to the park and do some body weight stuff maybe uh, on the bars and such, maybe some burpees on the little field. But yeah, gonna keep staying away from everyone and um, yeah, do my thing. Okay, and just like that, it's kind of starting to rain again. I really don't want to get this camera wet at all because it cost me a lot of money. And uh, yeah, just really don't want to risk it at all because it might start raining super hard really. So I'm actually gonna head back to the house. But you know, at least I got this uh, like 300 steps in. <laughs> so I actually decided to just go back outside and still do the walk around my neighborhood. It's about a square mile or so. Um, kind of just gonna turn this into like more like a speed walk. It's 12.50, so it's about a 45 minute walk. 24,500 steps and I'm at 3,200 calories burned. I'm just gonna take a small break and eat some breakfast. I am starving, but I will be back. I'm gonna charge my camera battery too because it's almost dead. I will see you in a little bit. Okay, so finally just got some breakfast in, feel way better, have a ton more energy. What I'm going to do actually is I'm going to, it sounds funny, but I'm going to uh, run in place actually in front of TV, in the TV while I watch an episode of one of my favorite shows called Psych. If you haven't seen it, it's so funny, you should definitely watch it. Obviously not going to record it like real time or time lots of me just running in front of the TV. So just finished that hour long running in place session. I actually spent 30 minutes of it running in place. And then 30 minutes, I have like a little stool stepper thing. So I just literally stepped up and down that thing for 30 minutes. And I know it sounds crazy, but I mean, it kept the heart rate relatively high. Pouring rain outside right now. So gonna stick indoors for a little bit longer. It is currently 2.30. 4,300 calories burned, 28,000 steps, 17.8 miles covered. At three, I think I'm going to try to do some burpees probably, maybe like a hundred or so, I don't know, around there. I just finished the burpees, I stopped at a hundred. That's literally all I could do and they took a while. Pretty much already in my running clothes so I'm just gonna go throw on my Patagonia jacket because this is what the weather's like outside, pretty windy and stuff. I will see you back either right before my run or after my run, but yeah. Okay, so just arrived at the spot. I decided to park on one of the sides of Central Park about a mile away from where the wetlands start, um, just to kind of force myself to go out a mile and come back a mile, just to um, kind of make it easier and make the loop feel shorter. Hopefully gonna go six or seven-ish miles right now, so at least 40 to 50 minutes and burn some extra calories. We're at just over 4,700 calories, but it's still not, not quite 4.30 yet. So we still got a lot of hours in the day left and I will see you after the run. And we're back from the run. It was absolutely pouring for pretty much the entire year of the run, like the last 30 to 40 minutes, but got it done. Like I thought my heart rate was nice and high, but we're still only at like 5,500 calories, I wanna say. See that, at 5,506, 37,000 steps. So we hit the halfway mark, which is awesome, but I still have 4,500 calories to go, but it's only a little past 5.30, so plenty of time still left, but I'm gonna go home, eat an absolutely huge dinner because I'm starving. Then I'm gonna do probably 60 to 90 minutes on the at-home stationary rower, which will hopefully burn a ton of calories. 
So I just made some dinner, have a big thing of angel hair pasta right here. Gonna crush it super fast because I'm absolutely starving. Wait like just a little bit of time, probably 20, 30 minutes to digest and then hop on the rower. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and hop on the rower now at just under 6,000 calories. Okay, so I just finished doing the rower and ended up only doing 5K because I was checking like my heart rate and it was sort of high, but not really as high as I wanted it to be, especially for like the effort you're expending. It's super difficult. Yeah, so I just did 5K on it. I think it burned like, I don't know, maybe a couple hundred calories. So we're at about 6,300 now, but it's 7.30. So starting to get late. Um, I think I'm gonna do another run in front of the TV, just in place. That seemed to actually do pretty well. Got my heart rate high and it's still pouring rain outside. So it is currently 10.30 p.m. I'm at a total of 7,094 calories burned, 45,000 steps, about 30 miles covered. Um, I haven't actually been exercising or doing anything for like the past hour. I kind of just decided to lay it to rest at around a little after 9 p.m. Because um, at that point, I kind of knew I was going to hit the 10,000 calories. The goal of today was really just to try to burn as many, many calories as I could with doing as many different things as I could, like as far as around the house and just like simple things that I would be able to do in a quarantine like we are in right now. Um, I think that I could have probably burned a lot more than the 7,000 and maybe even got past that 10,000 calorie mark if I were to just keep going on shorter runs. I definitely had some more some more miles in my legs, but I kind of didn't want to do it like that. I wanted to like really be versatile and try to like mix it up and see like all the different things I could do to get my heart rate high and really burn a lot of calories. I really did think even with that, with doing all the different things, I really thought I was going to be able to burn the 10,000 calories, but just didn't quite work out that way. Started the day probably later than I should have and also definitely did not eat enough calories. I probably only ate like, I don't know, 2,500, 3,000 calories. And towards the end, like I was trying to do whatever I could. I think my body was just so exhausted and so like spent of energy. But hey, uh, lesson learned. I think uh, today was a lot of fun. If you guys wouldn't mind hitting the like button, subscribing, hitting the notification bell and leaving a comment down below. That would be so amazing. Again, I am so, so, so thankful for hitting a thousand subscribers. It is amazing. And it's really, really helped me through this, through this, you know, interesting and, and different time. I'm a server at a restaurant. And so my um, income, usual income has been withered down to basically zero during this whole quarantine thing going on. So this has really helped um, take my mind off everything. And I know a bunch of you are also going through things with everything going on in the world right now. And I'm sure that people have it a lot worse than I do. Filming these videos and um, you know watching my subscriber count go up has really like helped me cope with everything that's going on. I just am so thankful and so grateful for every single one of you guys um, for watching and subscribing to my channel. It just means the absolute world to me. So with that being said, let me know what you guys want to see next. You know, this channel is all about trying to find happiness and, uh, you know, finding what makes me happy and hopefully inspi inspire you guys to find what makes you happy as well. My runs from today will be posted in my Strava, which I'll post the link down below and I'll uh, flash all the activities at the end of the screen right now um, to show you guys everything that I did today to burn 7,000 calories. As always, be good humans, do good things, search for happiness. Peace.